Macam lagi tu me. Have you seen the what are you doing? Uh, I'm hammering. An alien. Is that a phone? Yes. You are using a phone to you hammer an alien to a wall. Yeah, meeting a team ben apa? Okay, what is that phone? Uh, it says energizer. I can I have that back? I have some work to do with it. Uh, okay. Then morning. अरे कहाँ ना कहाँ लेने को हम एक चीज़ डाल हाय गैस एंड वेलकम गेम टू नाउ द रिव्यू वीडियो इफ यू वाचिंग द लास्ट फ्यू सेकंड्स ऑफ द वीडियो यू वर नोटिस लाइफ यू ट्राइंग टू हैमर एन एल इनटू अ वॉल यूजिंग अ फोन so as weird as it sounds, that's actually what happened and this is the phone I have with me. This is the Energizer Energy 400. So as you can see, the first thing you notice is this phone is quite, um, how do I put it, it's quite large. So this is my OnePlus 2 and you compare it, it's quite, it's like two phones, right? So yeah, it is also a very, when I say it's a hardy phone, I mean quite literally because you can do that and the phone doesn't break. So as you can see, it's the casing is quite thick. Um, it runs uh, basic. It runs Android KitKat, which is quite old. But then again, I mean, if you're on the field, then you need the phone to take a call. It doesn't matter if you have Android O or Android Gingerbread. I right? just need to take a call. So going further into the phone, uh, it's powered by a dual core one point three gigahertz processor and has 500 MB of RAM and 4 GB of internal storage with a micro SD card also supported with up to 64 GB so if you want to play your favorite tunes you just plug your micro SD card and you're good to go uh, in terms of camera you have an 8 megapixel camera at the back with a flash you also have a front camera if you want to take a selfie which I mean why not right and yeah so for the other thing is the phone as like I keep repeating this the phone is extremely hard it's quite durable you can like do that and nothing happens to the phone. Uh, it has a 2400 mAh battery which is removable. I'll get to that later. For now, I'll talk about the screen. So it looks like an average normal, you know, 4.0 inch normal 720p screen. It's actually a IP68 rated screen. So when you say IP68, that's a rating for industrial use. So essentially, if you say IP6, that is, so IP68 would mean it's waterproof and dustproof. So say you are going in the rain and phone suddenly gets wet, no biggie. You, have, you can submerge this phone in up to 1.8 meters of water and up to 33 minutes. So say you go for a swim or leave your phone at the bottom of the pool for half an hour, it will still work. If you want to go for a shower, you can still answer your phone in the shower. Uh, okay, so moving on to the battery, like I said, it's a 2400 mAh battery. Though they say it's removable, there's a bit of a catch you find out because as you can see there are two nails here, right? So removing the battery is a bit tricky. I'll just take out my trusty leather one here and show you. So screwdriver, do that, do that, and you see the two nails here, so you literally have to like do this. As you can see, when they said removal, they didn't mean easily removal, they just said removal. So that's one down, this is the other one, and these things are like removed. Okay, so that's done, okay, when it came off, okay, so when it comes out, there's a small, you can see there's a small ridge here, so don't put your finger near it there, because you're obviously going to break it. So try trying it open with maybe like a screwdriver or something and just try to open and voila, the cover comes off. Even the cover itself is quite thick, as you can see it's quite rigid and here you have the battery, you can just take that off. So it's an old battery and you have your SIM 1, SIM 2 and your micro SD slot. So it's actually a dual SIM phone with a micro SD slot as well. Um, Alright, so this is the phone and now on to the interesting parts, we are going to do a live drop test and maybe something a bit more. A few moments later. Mahesh, I need your phone. I don't have credit. Twelve seconds later. Fiori, catch. Can I wash the phone? It's dirty. Yeah, chef, use some soap. It's fine. Okay.
So there you have it guys. This is our video review of the Energizer Energy 400 smartphone. Uh, as you can see we did a drop test. We also did a soak test. We also did a battery test to show you how long the battery is. So overall the phone is quite sturdy and quite strong. Um, in terms of performance, you're not gonna get like blistering performance compared to flagships of today because then again this is a two year old smartphone. But if you're on the lookout for a smartphone that won't break like most smartphones do nowadays and if you want a phone that can go through with the normal wear and tear with a few drops and maybe like throw it to your friends or even play catch with it uh, this is a good phone uh, so this goes for about 24,000 in the local market uh, you have to probably dig around and find a few places that sell it but if you do and if you are looking on if you are on the lookout for a phone like this I would I do encourage you to give it a go so if you liked our video hit the subscribe button down below uh, if you would like us to review any, oops, sorry about that. If you would like us to review anything else that you would you feel interesting, please leave a comment in the section below. And uh, we'll hope to see you again the next time with something more cooler. And that's it. See you. Hmm. Now where did I leave that hammer of mine? Hmm.